everybody, it's Amy. Uh, welcome back to A Year in the Life of a Professional Crafter. This is update 29 according to my notes and uh, I am committed to busting these out and making sure that I have the whole series for you. So uh, I reread my blog in 2016. Hello, today is... It's 2018 already. Um, in 2016, I uh, kept a log of every day of my life, um, quite literally. And um, since I am a professional crafter, um, I wrote down everything I was doing. And so now I'm going back and looking at the um, blog entry that I made and filling in the gaps. So uh, for update 29, for week 29, it was July, I think, of that year. Um, and I wanted to mention um, to those of you, okay, you have a craft business or you're starting a craft business, um, these are just some reminders that I remember and wrote down in my notes. That's what I keep looking at. So um, number one, uh, you are the only one who can do the dirty work. So you have to commit to doing it. Uh, nobody else is going to do the dirty work for you in your business. You are the one who has to do it. Um, there was a there was a really dirty moment <clears throat> in that uh, week. Uh, I was shoveling dirt to protect the basement from being flooded out in the middle of a hail like a rain and hailstorm, and yeah, it was very Hollywood. And uh, but I was doing that, and I read it and was thinking to myself, yeah, that's. That's being in business for yourself. I mean, it's not really directly related to business, but the dirty work that we have to do in our business, we have to do. Um, yeah, you can hire things out that aren't really dirty work. Um, there, there are some things that only you can do is the point that I want to make. Number two, um, oh, <laughs> number two, when you have a good hair and makeup day, this is pretty good. Got my hair cut. Don't know what you think. Leave a comment like I care. Um, that's one of, I don't have resolutions, but I've decided I don't care anymore what people think. I only care what I think. Um, that's how I used to be like until age, I don't know, 25 or something. And then I don't know what happened. When you have a good hair and makeup day, um, use it, okay? Make the video. Go to the meeting. <clears throat> do the thing you need to do. Um, take advantage. So so what I'm really trying to say is take advantage of the time you have. The time is now for you to do the thing. Um, and one more thing. The third thing I wanted to mention in this little update is to remember to give back. I had mentioned in that blog post that uh, I took my daughter, we got our stuff together and went to a shelter where I work. I have a friend who runs a women's shelter once a month, an overnight shelter for homeless women. And uh, we work there once a month with her and uh, serve dinner. We set up the beds, uh, that kind of thing. Um, just remember to give back somehow, somewhere, some way. You don't have to do what I do, obviously. Everybody does their own thing. But um, remembering to give back, what goes around comes around, and I truly believe that. And so I think that's a good way to have <clears throat> an idea in your head with business as well. Maybe think about how your business can give back to society somehow. It's going to uh, it's gonna be good for your heart, and it's going to be good for your life, and it's going to be good for society. So do that. So that's my update 29, a really quick one for you. Uh, please... Um, uh, if you want to be on my newsletter list, I'm going to have a link in the description uh, so that you can read all of these updates. Um, if you want to get on my newsletter list, when I'm done with all these updates, I'm creating all of them, all of the written blog posts into an ebook that I will be giving away for free. So um, you can join my newsletter list and then you will be one of the first people to get that ebook for free. Um, and I'm also going to create a uh, tip of the week uh, email thing that I'm doing. Anyway, just sign up for my newsletter. There's a lots of things that I'm doing this year and uh, I would love to keep in touch with you. Uh, you can keep in touch on Twitter and Instagram and I have a Facebook group if you're interested in that. I'll put the link for that as well. So thanks for watching. Click subscribe if you haven't already so you can continue to get these updates. I hope 2018 is a great year for you. Uh, take care. Bye!